The following is a presentation of the Eagles Sports Network. Yeah, Lane Bloom here after the game, a 40-20 to 20 loss. Lane, uh, obviously 40 points on the scoreboard. Offense gave you some short fields uh, with some of their turnovers. Uh, how do you think that the defense played as a whole today? I think as a whole, we've got some things to work on, you know, a few big plays that we need to take away, some missed tackles. But I'm incredibly proud, proud of the way we played, you know, in the red zone, holding them to three consecutive field goals and just playing our hearts out here towards the end. I mean, it's definitely a game that we're going to have to build off of, but everybody clawed and, and fought, and I couldn't be more proud of the defense. I mean, I know our offense fought just as hard, so, I mean, it's just a tough pill to swallow. Um, and I think, you know, we're just going to have to build. How much does that enthusiasm there at the end and the willingness not to quit at the very end of the game help bring some confidence to this team heading into next week? And I've got complete confidence in both sides of our ball. Mm -hmm. uh, our offense is more than capable, you know. If you look at it, we, we handed it to them, mm -hmm. and that's just something we can't do. And then defensively, I mean, I'll go to war with these guys. Mm -hmm. Every one of them's got tremendous heart, tremendous ability, and we can definitely get the job done. And I'm excited to see how we build off it. And, um, you know, it's like I said, it's, it's a tough one. It's, you never want to lose like this. Mm -hmm. You never want to lose your first conference game of the season. But, you know, it's done with now, and we're, we're going to have to start preparing for next week. What kind of adjustments did you make? It seemed like the first quarter and a half or so, they were able to convert on third downs. They were able to move the ball pretty successfully. And then in the second half, you, like you said, you got off the field on third down situations. What did you guys change? Uh, I think we were just we were bluffing a little bit and, and just kind of playing into their, their game. You know, quarterback's going under center. He's checking calls, checking based on where our linebackers are lined up or what coverage he's seeing. And, you know, we were mixing up our looks. And it helped us out a little bit. Granted, but there's still a few third downs where they ran uh, that dig and hit that weak side receiver for a few first downs. But I think overall, we came in, we made some good adjustments that helped us out. But like I said, you know, it's still a lot to do. How do you guys collect yourself? Uh, obviously a one and two start, not how you, how you envision this season to begin. But how do you collect yourselves knowing that you get two home games back to back and get things back on the right track? I think two home games are gonna be important. You know, we're gonna be playing in front of our people and, and our, at our field, you know, where we're more comfortable. but. I also know that it's going to be tough, but we did, you know, it happened last year. Look at last year, we started off kind of a similar road. Right. So I know that we're more than capable of bouncing back and, and getting to where we want to be this season. Mm -hmm. It's just a matter of are we going to, um, you know, put in the work and put in the time to do it. Lane, thanks for the time. Best of luck next Thank week. Thank you, Michael.